All right, today we have something really fun planned. I'm super excited for it. We got our matching shirts. We're at a Bucks game today. You have never been to an NFL game. Not an NFL game. This is gonna be a new experience for us because we're here um, in this crazy parking lot with tailgaters. Lot tailgaters and a lot of cars. Let's go check it out. Probably gonna be pretty hard to film all of this, but there's just a lot of tents, a lot of people sitting out. Stadium's right there. And this is Lot 14, and you can purchase tickets for Lot 14 online. I think it was right around $50 per car, and I would highly recommend purchasing parking because it was kind of crazy to get in. You had to go all the way down this road and over here and all the way back around. But you can see Lot 14's pretty close to the stadium, not that far of a walk. Now, we were lucky to even get tickets for this game. Today, they are playing the Atlanta Falcons, and since Tom Brady has come to town, tickets, very expensive. Just a few years ago, they were giving them away for free. Now you're lucky to even get any sort of ticket. But we got tickets, we're very, very high up, but it's more of the experience coming and getting to see them play and going to a Bucks game. You see they got cornhole sitting out here, but all of us have matching shirts. We found them at Dick's Sporting Goods on sale. Pretty nice, they're actually Nike shirts. So we got our gear. See, there's a grill going right here. Here are the matching shirts, all geared up and ready to go. Looks like walk across the road somewhere up here and then we should be able to get in. Looks like we possibly can cross right here. That looks like where everybody's going, but oh man, it's kind of a little dangerous thing through here. Woo. There's also a ton of parking options here. We wanted something relatively close and not super expensive. You can see here's a whole nother parking lot you can park in. Here is a game day checklist. Open your mobile ticket app for easy entry. No bags over four and a half by six and a half. Scanner to access your Bucks account. Have tickets ready. You can see on this side, there's the pirate ship right there. Big go Bucks sign. If you need help, they have plenty of workers out here with signs that say, can I help you? I'm guessing we go through these metal detectors, maybe? All right, they just said 11.30 is entry time. So it looks like we got about 30 minutes to hang out here until we can go in. Over by gate C, which I think is around the corner over that way, if you do take an item that's too big, they have lockers. And he said he thinks it's about $10, but you can store your stuff in there if you need to. Also above the metal detectors it says leave all items in pockets you can see there are some porter potties down there a big bucks flag and people are starting to line up now i think we've got maybe around 15 more minutes before we're good to go and we're going to be in this section over here close to the ship so if they get a touchdown we should have a good view of seeing that yes thank you when they get a touchdown if they don't get a touchdown today never coming back <laughs> one and done that's a bold statement I'll do my best to film kind of the experience and the venue and all that. And then some of the game, obviously I can't show all the game, but I'll try to put some clips in there of the game. Maybe I can get Tom Brady throwing a touchdown pass. That'd be pretty cool. You can see there's quite a bit of people now. I think we've got about five minutes and I probably won't be able to film going through or scanning our tickets because the tickets are on my phone. But once we get past all that, I'll be able to see where we're at. All right, we made it through. Got a compliment on the shirt. Now we're gonna head up the escalators. Right here where everybody else is going all the way to the very, very top. That wasn't that hard of a process. A tip I would say is get there before other people do because it went super fast for us. We're at like the front of the Yeah. Wow, look at this. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to hit the next one to the very top, but this is a huge stadium. It's like most people like the section 200s and 100s. We prefer the 300s. Yeah, we're an elite crew. <laughs> right. And you can see right over on this side, there's downtown Tampa, right there. Oh yeah, we're gonna have a great view up here though. <laughs> Sections 327 and 344, I think, I'll have to look, I think I said we're 320, 341. <laughs> I, I'll have to look, but it's definitely this way. Right now we're greeted with some restrooms, so, some cold beer and water. A nice breeze, look at that. Good breeze up here. <laughs> restrooms women's here so men's must be somewhere else and we're in section 341 so just around here row y 
seats 24, 25, 26, 27. There's a team store and they have this grill right here where you can get some food. Look at this view though. That is a great view of the parking lot, downtown Tampa, men restrooms. Our men restrooms down here, down there. It's actually, yeah, there's men right there. It's actually really nice up here. Yeah, look at this view. I'm gonna try to zoom in here. There's a lot of like little like food booths, food trucks. There's another barbecue place here. We're, we're gonna get some food, sideline salsa. I'm not sure what we're gonna get. It might just be kind of a walk and see. And I won't be able to show everything out here, but um, we'll show you what we'll get. I don't want this video to be like, you know, 40 minutes long either. So hopefully it won't be. Look at the tables with the Bucks flag in there. And also look how ginormous that flag right there is. Since the lines aren't too long right now, we're gonna walk and see what a good place to eat at would be. Um, there's quite a bit of options, which is really cool. And it doesn't seem too crowded right at the moment. There's nachos. Here's the sideline salsa. What they got? They got some tacos, some nachos. Little Caesars over here. I prefer Papa John's. It's a lightning. <laughs> yeah. It is a little warm today, which I'm thankful because it's not raining, but it's what, going to be 86-ish? Yeah. And I it's mean, good breeze, there's no shade. But luckily, I think the way the sun is, and we're on this side, I don't think the sun's going to be in our face. Plenty of restrooms all the way around as well. We have the first down deli and dogs, hot dogs, Cuban sandwich, pretzel, popcorn, goal line stand. See what that is over there. Hot dogs, nachos, same sort of thing. Look at the popcorn bucket, though. That's really cool. I think she's looking at maybe getting some nachos and I'm looking at getting a hot dog. I actually think what we're going to end up doing is going at goal, goal line stand. Look at them nachos. They have a hot dog and nachos. It looks like it's a, ooh, a foot long. We're going to do it. Stadium nachos. We'll get a drink. And then it does say cashless payment required. All right, here's the nachos huge hot dog and they put the all the ketchup mustard stuff underneath popcorn our souvenir cup a water and total was $46 however you get free refills on the popcorn and the drink we're gonna head up now to our section and see what it looks like at our seats you can see it is getting a little bit more busy here but the game I think starts in about about an hour. We're right here at 341 seats, 18 through 33. Wow, look at that. Wow. We're gonna be, there's 341, so we're gonna be right up there. We're heading up the stairs, row Y, so you can see 341 here. See, we're not all the way at the back yet. Look at that. This is the view, it's actually a really good view though. There's not a bad view in here, it looks like, and having the ship right there is really awesome. There's an airplane over here, but we are right next to the speakers. We got Tom Brady down there. Some of the Atlanta Falcons players just came out as well. Getting ready to run out. There's definitely a little bit of a breeze, but the but stadium blocks it. Way, yeah. yeah. 86 degrees, warm and dry. 3 p.m. will be 89 degrees.
First quarter, still not much happened. It's zero, zero. Start of the second, Bucks ball, got the whole flow to go. Ball on the 12 yard line. score but it's the two minute warning till the quarter ends 7-0 bucks three seconds left they're going to try to kick a field goal in order to make it 13-0 before half let's see if he makes it oh yeah we're gonna head down here and just get in the breeze for a little bit because it is a scorcher. You can see the crowd down here. Everybody's trying to get to the shade. Everybody's just kind of hanging out in the shade, actually. We are leaning up against this brick cool wall. I, mean, I don't know if you can see or not, but see how red that is? Hand all red. Yeah, good grief. It is extremely hot. I ended up getting this hint of pineapple mango seltzer. It's actually really good, but it's more to put on my sunburn because that's nice and cool. Game's back on. It's now Tampa's ball. the end of the third quarter. Score is 21-0. All right, Atlanta just scored, so it's gonna be probably 21-7. Looks like they're gonna kick the field goal, so still a very big lead, and it's the fourth quarter. Definitely got some sun on the legs, ouch, and on the arm. Timber got us some wet, like, paper towels from the bathroom to cover our four legs. Whatever we can, yeah. Well, Atlanta just scored. Somebody's hurt, but if they kick the field goal, it'll be 14 to 21, which is a one score game with under five left. So it's still kind of anybody's game. I don't know why Tampa stopped playing a little bit. 
And the Tampa player is walking off by himself, so that's good news. Atlanta is going for two. Wow. And they got it. Wow, it is 15 to 21. Mariota's pass. Tampa just got a first down, so it looks like that it's gonna go down to the two minute, and I think should be good. And then Tampa just took a knee, so they're gonna run out the clock. 30 seconds, they just got the victory. All right, there it is. All right, we're heading out with this ginormous crowd. And it seems like most people have left by now, so we're gonna go out to the car. This is everybody waiting on the escalator. We, I guess we're going down the ramp because there's still, the escalator is not going right at the moment. I don't know why they're waiting on it, so we're just gonna follow the ramp. See everybody heading out and leaving, and all the cars in the parking lot. We've made it down to the 100s, so we're getting close to the ground level. crossing right here there's a lot of traffic wow all right we've almost made it back to our car and quite a bit of people have left but there's still a long line to get out all right we made it back to the car and that was our trip out to the tampa bay bucks game glad they got the win it looked a little scary there at the end yeah i i watched it from down below in the shade a couple tips one is get here early yep Two, well. two is load yourself up full of sunscreen. We did our faces, but not our legs. Three is save as much money as you possibly can to either get a suite or maybe you can get a good seat on like a Sunday night or Monday night or Thursday night game or just come in the in like the more winter time in Florida because that was extremely hot. This toasty. It stinks because it's been low 80s all week, but today it felt like 97. Yeah. It was fun though. I think yeah, it was. Glad we went. Yeah, and I think it was more of just seeing Tom Brady. So yeah. we'll probably watch the rest of them from our air conditioned couch. For sure. But we can always say we saw him. And that was your first NFL game. Yeah, it was good. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.